Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, sorry, it's been a bit of a break. Uh, I've been back at work in the office, um, so I've not been able to do quite as much as I've wanted to do. Um, this is the first of three videos we'll be releasing over the next week. Um, so, with this one, I'm just going to go through uh, one of the most requested things I have with HUD the stowage on the side of my executioners. So, we're going to kick it straight off and start by cleaning up the pieces. Uh, once we've cleaned them all up, uh, we'll be back. product mention um, best glue I've ever used by far is the new uh, AK interactive quick cement extra thin uh, it's a liquid poly cement comes with a brush applicator and the lid um, absolutely outstanding the way the glue works with the plastic uh, melts it you can use it to get rid of uh, mold lines you can use it to fill gaps uh, if you use the brush applicator and paste it over a few times you, you can use it to get rid of some impurities as well I cannot recommend this enough <laughs> stick the three fuel canisters together um, just to make a solid one piece part um, so it's easier to paint and also easier to move around so there's not uh, multiple parts floating about. more base, uh, drill a couple of holes in it and then take the 1mm uh, brass wire and basically bend that around the calluses using the pliers to get a nice right angle and then make sure the thing is nice and tight. Uh, once that's done, uh, that will be bent into place and then glued uh, around the calluses but not gluing the calluses in uh, just so we can keep them separate from painting. Um, but yeah, I'm going to leave you guys to it uh, we'll come back once these parts are all done. <laughs>
video uh, we had the leftover flat green stuff that I rolled out uh, so what I'm going to do here I'm just going to cut a small strip off we'll be gluing that to the bottom and that'll form the uh, under strap part of uh, the framework for it um, so once we've got that glued down uh, I'll be back and we'll just summarize up the video <laughs> thing with it separate it's a really tight snug fit um, into the framework there so once it's on the side of a tank you can just easily remove these for painting and then glue them back into place uh, once you are ready and finished uh, and that's something I just want to add uh, I did do this on purpose I cut this one a little bit short so just to make sure that you are measuring out um, if anything try and do the straps extra long uh, and you can always cut away the excess as opposed to doing too little and having a little gap although saying that a little gap is easy to amend just a little bit of green stuff. Uh, well, that's the end of this video, guys. Uh, thanks very much for tuning in. Um, we'll see you next time, which will be very, very shortly. As always, please like, uh, share, and subscribe. And uh, if you haven't done already, uh, go to my Instagram page. I also have a new Facebook page as well now. Uh, but yeah, that's it, guys. Peace out.